You're going to start with a square sheet of paper, and we're going to fold a bird base. So you already know how to do that, but I'm going to show you. So first, with the white side up, if you have two-sided paper, we're going to fold in half, unfold, and fold in half in this direction. Then we're going to unfold, turn the paper over, and then fold diagonals. And the other one. Unfold, turn the paper over, and then we're just going to collapse the square base by taking these two corners and bringing it to here. And it'll kind of just naturally form. And then push this down. So all four corners are at the bottom. And what we're going to do now is fold this edge to this crease, making sure the open side is down. Just like this. Now we're going to do the same on this side. Then we're going to fold along this edge. Fold this corner down. Then turn over and fold both of these edges to the middle crease again. And turn over, unfold these two flaps, and then we're going to lift up this layer, and this will kind of get unfolded, and we're going to fold along this crease, and this crease, and then reversing these two folds, so from a valley fold, to a mountain fold. Like this. Turn over, unfold these, lift this up, and then just reverse that crease there. Fold in along these, just like you did last time. Reverse folding, and then collapse. Now we're just going to fold these back down again. And it's totally symmetrical on all four of these flaps. Now what we're going to do is lift these flaps up like this. It's called the bird base twist star because you're twisting here. So you kind of open it up. Here, you can hold this together, spread these layers like this, and then just take this flap and flip it this way. Now, you could make it twist in whatever direction you want. I'm going to do it in this direction, so that's why I flip it that way. This one's going that way. Same here, we're going to flip it this way. We're not making any creases yet, we're just bending it. So you kind of see how it's twisting. But what we're going to do is make 
this corner go on that middle crease. Make it just sit right on there. And then do that with all these flaps. Trying to make it symmetrical. And you'll probably have to adjust it. And it won't lie flat yet. Then we're just going to hold all these in place at the same time and then just squash this tip. So if we pull on these all, all these layers, you'll kind of see that getting spread out. And it'll make like this little square. Slowly squash it and flatten. And even mine aren't totally flat, it's kind of like curved, feels like it, but that doesn't matter. So it's done, our bird-based spiral star.